Hey, this is Akra Kuma, or somebody know me as Kid Guru. This is my first Windows Vista tutorial. In today's tutorial, if you notice when you go to your start menu, and this right here is set to sleep by default. Now, uh, let's say you want to change that. Now, I'm going to show you the way to change it. Now, this can apply if you have a laptop. Uh, I have a lot, I'm using on a laptop right now, but I believe also if you have a PC, I'll have the power options as well. So, first you want to right click on your desktop, go down to personalize, and go to screensaver now why are we going to screensaver because it lets you uh or you can go to control panel and go to personalized settings and just go to your power management i mean sorry hard uh control panel hardware and sound and then go to uh power management but i'm just gonna show you this way so go to down here it says power manager and change power settings now if you have a laptop it's going to be different it's going to show your plan settings also you know yeah uh, some i don't know there might be some power settings even if you have like just a desktop that has this done installed onto it so whatever you see then but you will probably see right here if you change plan settings if you click this and just wait and then go to change advanced power settings and as you see here it's going to say power buttons and lids click that and click start menu power button and as you see here, it's going to say on battery if you have a laptop and plugged in. Now what this means is, uh, turn it shut down. What this means is if it, your battery is running on your laptop without it being plugged in, then, uh, you know, you're, if you have a battery plugged in, as in no cord is charging it, then it's going to shut down. Now if you have a cord plugged in, you can change the object for that, but I like it both being on shutdown. And you just hit apply, okay. Now if you have a, a desktop and it doesn't have, like, on battery or plugged in, here I'm going to show you that way too. You can either go to the screensaver way and manage your way through there, or open go to your start menu, open up your con oh sorry, oopsie daisy is wrong one. Go to control, and then uh, hang on, just couple closes. This go to hardware and sound. You should have that even if you're using a desktop that has Windows and Vista. And f uh five spaces down you'll see power options now all computers will have this e if you have vista installed you have battery settings or in your computer right here it says change what the power buttons do you can either go there also for changing your uh, settings for your now let's say you have a power button on your laptop or whatever or if you have this on your uh, you have these on your computer uh, you have an additional option if you have a laptop, says when I close the lid, or if you have a computer and you have these buttons, so you should probably do that sleep and uh, the power button. Now you can change that to uh, do nothing, hibernate, sleep, when I press the sleep button, you know, you can just change. Now this will have this on your uh, desktop PC because you have these buttons on your uh, your main uh, case, in the, your casing, and uh, you know, you can just change what it does if you want. And also, again, if you want to change your. Uh, thing on your start menu for a desktop PC just go to your power options and navigate to the left and it should say uh, something and you can say change plan settings and just click that and then you know change it to whatever and then go to uh, and then again let me show you a review go to change advanced power settings and then go to PC power buttons and lid if you have lid your P, uh, laptop start menu power button they'll all have that so just go to that and change it however you want now there you go that's the laptop and desktop way both uh, laptop just a little bit more different because it has a lid and has a little bit more options because it has battery and plug-in so that's all for today I hope you enjoyed this tutorial please leave me feedback comment and rate my videos as well as subscribe if you really like them anyways thanks for watching